What's going on YouTube? Just right here. So in today's video we're discussing about a brand new Misaka update that was just released. If you're using Misaka, the package manager that allows you to install tweaks and themes on iOS without being jailbroken, you should update your Misaka right now. We're gonna get into that in a second. This video is brought to you by FormiKey, a software that allows you to bypass the activation lock. If you bought a second-hand device and it turned out locked or you got scammed on eBay or Facebook groups and stuff like that, and you can also turn off the camera sound and even remove the Apple ID from the device if you forgot it and it does support iOS 15 and 16. Definitely check the program out in the link below. A free trial is available for both Windows and Mac OS and it supports all the way up to iOS 16.7. So just a couple of hours ago we got the Misaka 8.1.2 which is now available and the fixes in it are filtering avoidance for AT&T, no idea what that means, and no feature additions or bug fixes. So this is just one change if you need to get this. The version 8.1.1 released three days ago fixed an issue with KFD so if you didn't update to 8.1.1. At this point you should update to 8.1.2. I'm assuming this would help people who are using AT&T as their carrier, but um, you should update to the latest version nonetheless. There are two versions in here, Misaka 8.1.2 IPA or TIPA if you want to install it with Troll Store, and the M1 and M2 version. You should use this one only on M1 and M2 devices. So yeah, that's basically it with the Misaka, but the developer behind Misaka also is looking for development team members for the Misaka project. They are planning to essentially do something like the serotonin jailbreak that was just released or like the uh, root height bootstrap with tweak injection like real jailbreak tweak injection in Springboard and apps and stuff. So if you want to join, if you are a developer and you want to join, you should definitely contact Straight Tamago on Twitter and talk to them. Required skills including here Objective C knowledge, Little Swift and knowledge of the bootstrap. You should understand how the bootstrap from root height works and of course other such things like tweak injection and you know jailbreak knowledge, general jailbreak knowledge and C. This could turn out like an interesting project. Speaking of interesting projects, a serotonin jailbreak allows you to essentially install tweaks, real jailbreak tweaks in the springboard and on apps and stuff if you combine it with the root hide. This is essentially the very first jailbreak for iOS 16.0 all the way up to 16.6.1 even on newer devices like 8.12 and stuff. Yeah, If you want to use like real jailbreak tweaks and you don't want to use Misaka anymore, this is a very good Misaka alternative that actually can install jailbreak tweaks. So definitely check it out. I do have a video about it and an article on iDeviceCentral.com. Thank you for watching. I am GSNow. Till the next time, subscribe to stay updated and peace out.